This photo shows the right side mount as indicated by the red arrow on a 4MATIC model. With the alternator removed, you have access to the mount which can be easily replaced. To replace the right side mount, start by removing the alternator. Please see the links at the end of this video for additional assistance. Working from below on the right side subframe, remove the 13mm lower mounting fastener as indicated by the red arrow. Next, remove the upper mount fastener, red arrow. This bolt is notoriously hard to break free. This is due to the size and the lack of access. I suggest using a 16mm wrench to break it free. Then remove it using a long extension. When replacing the right size mount, you will want to jack as close to the engine mount bracket as possible. Next, support the engine from below using a jack. Place a block of wood between the corner of the oil pan and the jack pad. Raise the jack until the engine mount bracket, red arrow, is about one inch from the mount. Remove the mount from the subframe through the front of the engine. If you have a rear wheel drive model, you will simply remove the mount from below, pulling it out from between the engine and the subframe. Install the new engine mount. Be sure that the mounting tab, red arrow, lines up with the slot, green arrow, on the engine mounting bracket. Slowly lower the engine down onto the mount. Install the new engine mount nuts and torque. Working on the left side subframe, remove the 13mm lower motor mount fastener, as indicated by the red arrow. Next, remove the upper motor mount fastener, as indicated by the red arrow. This bolt is notoriously hard to break free as well. This is due to its size and also the lack of access. Again, I suggest using a 16mm wrench to break it free, then removing it with a long extension. For the left side, it's a bit easier to break it free with a wrench from below. Remove the left side drive axle. Please see the link at the end of this video for front drive axle replacement. When replacing the left side mount, you will want to jack as close to the engine bracket as possible. Next, support the engine from below using a jack. Again, place a block of wood between a corner of the engine oil pan and the jack pad. Raise the jack until the engine mount bracket is about one inch from the mount. Remove the mount from the subframe through the drive axle area. If you have a rear wheel drive vehicle, you will simply remove the mount from below, pulling it out from between the engine and the subframe. Again, install a new engine mount, being sure that the mounting tab, red arrow, lines up with the slot, green arrow, on the engine mounting bracket. Slowly lower the engine down onto the mount, install the new engine mount nuts, and torque. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article, along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.